In this year for NHL 16 HUT, chemistry is crucial for making your ultimate team play at its very best. With better chemistry, passes will connect easier, players set up for one-timers more effectively, and each player will receive a boost if they have better chemistry with line mates. The first thing we are going to be talking about are the most effective player types to use for your lineups. For example, three snipers on the same line will not perform optimally together. However, if you have a line with two playmakers and a sniper, or a line with three two-way forwards, your line chemistry will go up. On the screen now, and in the description box below, I will put a full list of player types that will work together in NHL 16 HUD. Here are the line combinations that work well for defensemen to get 100 chemistry. Use these combinations for your reference because there are a lot of different lineups that you will need to remember in the future. Another way to tell when you have achieved good chemistry is with the chart at the top right. You will see a red dot when chemistry is poor, a yellow dot which indicates somewhat good chemistry, and a green dot when you have achieved great chemistry. Also, having players in their correct position, having players familiar with each other with the same change team, and having a good line mix will all help improve your chemistry. Now that we talked about how to match up player types, let's move on to change team cards. Change team cards can be bought from the marketplace in the training section, or they can be pulled in gold packs from the store. When you begin to apply change team cards on your players, green lines will indicate that you have completed a change team connection. Having all three players with the same change team card on the same lineup, you will get the maximum amount of chemistry available for having all the same change teams. Here is a different scenario though. On your team, you might have a player out of position in one of your lineups. Every offensive lineup should have a left winger, a centerman, and a right winger. However, you might want a player to play out of position sometimes. If you want to move a player to a different position, but still want to achieve perfect chemistry, what you can do is apply what is known as a position change card on a player. Once again, the change position cards can be pulled in either gold packs or be bought from the training section in the marketplace. Here's a small tip to save you some coins in the long run. Change teams and position change cards can be costly to buy from the marketplace sometimes, so I highly recommend that you look out for players in the marketplace that already have a change team or a change position already applied to it already. Anyways guys, congratulations for making it all the way until the end of this video. That's practically everything you need to know about getting 100 team chemistry in NHL and basically how to get your hockey ultimate team to play at its maximum potential. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and make sure if you're new here, subscribe for more in-depth tutorials as well as comment in the comment section below if you have any questions. And to the rest of you guys, thanks so much for watching. Smash that like button once again and I'll see you guys later in the next video. Bye.